Baseball fans across the country are talking about the Greenville North State All-Stars tonight. The team won their first game in the Little League World Series last night and made history in the process. WNCT's Ken Watling continues our coverage from Williamsport, Pennsylvania. It turned out to be a history-making start to the Little League World Series for Greenville North State. Three pitchers combined to throw a perfect game, the first in the Little League World Series since 2008. There to see it, hundreds of North State fans, friends, and family members. That includes former Greenville Mayor Alan Thomas and his family. If someone checked the population in Greenville right now, it may be cut in half. There are so many people from eastern North Carolina here, and uh, not just from Greenville. I've seen a lot of people from all over North Carolina here to support. And as Williamsport turns into Greenville North, those not here are watching on television. And so are many, many more across the nation. Its exposure for Greenville, Thomas says, is invaluable. It's built over the past couple of weeks. I mean, these young guys with North State and, and uh, getting the talking about Greenville, talking about the community, talking with our coaches and our players. Players. They've just done such a wonderful job in representing our community. I'm just so proud of them. And all the support in the stands in Williamsport is definitely being felt by the North State players and coaches. It's crazy. I mean, how many people actually came down here, drove up here to support us and watch us play? They have been behind us um, really since the state tournament. And, um, you know, it, it doesn't surprise me, but. Did I think it was going to be really like that? Um, they were loud. Um, they were they were like the you know the tenth man up there, um, and we, we're going to need those folks because um, we, we're going to be playing some great teams. Next up for North State, California, tomorrow at 2 o'clock. Of course, WNCT will have all the up-to-date information and highlights on air and online at WNCT.com.